families could see some new rules for driving on the beach, and it comes after an increase of complaints in Nassau County. Action News Jack's Brittany Donovan shows us the change already being considered and how some neighbors are coming together to fight new restrictions. Susan King raised her kids in Fernandina Beach. She says she and her husband would drive out to a tide pool where the kids could play, park their car, and spend all afternoon. You could bring your cooler down and your trucks, and we would come and set up volleyball nets and cornhole. She's among locals who say they don't want more restrictions on beach driving. One neighbor started this petition, saying some Amelia Island homeowners want to outlaw driving on the beach everywhere it's currently allowed. I asked county leaders and found out they're not considering an outright ban, but they are asking families for input on current ordinances. Leaders tell me they've seen an increase in the number of complaints related to people driving on the beach, but locals tell me it's one of the easiest ways for families to get out and enjoy a day together near the water. County Commissioner Aaron Bell told me calls to the sheriff's office about beach issues have markedly increased since 2016, specifically at Peters Point and American Beach. Fernandina Beach Mayor Johnny Miller told me they've also gotten complaints, and people getting stuck has been an issue. Four wheel drive has always been a requirement. Miller says a bill will soon go through a second reading that will allow the city to ticket drivers who ignore that rule. Another meeting with Nassau County commissioners is planned for May 15th. As for King, don't want to see it being taken away. She says she hopes families can continue to enjoy driving to their favorite spot on the beach. Reporting in Nassau County, Brittany Donovan, CBS 47, Action News Jax.